South Dakota says unemployment rates are headed back toward pre-pandemic levels. However, staff shortages are still a major problem. Valley News Team's Aaron Walling explains the pressure that a lack of workers is putting on local businesses. During any given week, the Tavern Grow in Fargo serves around 7,000 people. The challenge for all involved continues to be getting the job done with half the staff. But it's definitely been a struggle. It's hard to definitely find people in all sorts of positions that everywhere is hiring for. But the lack of employees isn't new, dating back to before the pandemic. North Dakota had more jobs than applicants, uh, so it is um, something that we are very familiar with. Workforce shortage was an issue before the pandemic, uh, and it's still probably going to continue to be even after the pandemic influences are, are diminishing. We're still going to have that workforce shortage just like we had before, and really it comes down to there's just there's not enough people. In fact, when we tried to get other restaurants to comment on this continuing problem, many said no. They said they were too busy because they were short-staffed. So we just ask everyone to bear with us because they are working their hardest to give you the best experience, the best food quality, and everything we possibly can. The one bright spot for businesses is that despite a lack of workers, they are seeing more people out and about. Oh, it's so wonderful. Uh, when you think about it a year ago and all we were doing was packing food to go for the community, it's so great to be able to let them come in. In Fargo, Aaron Walling, Valley News Live. If you or someone you know is looking for work, visit our website for more information on job services here in the Fargo-Moorhead area.